Greetings fellow Earthlings and welcome to the start of the Civilization V Rise of Mordor series and as you can probably tell I'm playing as Mordor because that's why it's called the Rise of Mordor. Yeah, that made sense. This um, mod I'll probably leave um, links to all the mods in the description below, there's about 10 of them running all together. Um, different wonders such as Baradur and um, all of the um, nations for it. This is not a Middle Earth map, this is just a normal Pangea. Um, yeah, basically, I didn't want to have just a Middle Earth map. It, I'd have started in Tundra as Mordor, and me being called Melkor, I had to choose Mordor sort of thing. It's, it just works better that way. So I'm going to find my city. Um, I'll move my worker, warrior first. And we found a rune. Um, I'll go through um, Mordor in a bit more de depth later on, but for now I'm going to find my city near these two bananas. Mordor, a kingdom run by bananas right now. Um, and I'll be wanting, as always, um, a scout or a monument. Don't be a monument. Um, this is a small map, 14 nations. Um, there is a mod also running the times 100% technology tree making um, technologies take much longer to um, research. Basically it means that we don't end up being Mordor with tanks, we stay as Mordor with our Orc units and, um, yeah, and Baradur keep all those in so we don't end up with modern infantry being used by um, Middle Earth nations. Yep, so I'm gonna end the first turn. And we have found Umbar. Um, I don't know how that's pronounced, but oh well. Umbar, um, these were the Corsairs or the pirates um, who lived in Umbar. Um, Umbar is a city near Harad. Um, well, in Harad, the big desert to the south. Yeah, we've met Umbar. Let's have a look at Mordor. Let's see what they like. So, Sauron, big, um, unique thing, whatever it's called. Great generals are earned 25% faster. So that's the same as China. China have that same thing and pay 25% less for land units. So that's a German thing they've got there. Um, Bismarck has that with his German things. Um, let's try the Nazgul. So these are great generals. Um, I believe they act like a great can. Um, the Mongolian Great Khan, that is, so we get a Nazgul instead. And a Moranon Orc. Moranon is um, just part of Mordor. Um, it's like a county of Mordor, but it's not a county, but, you know, it's, it's similar. Self-healing melee unit because it eats other soldiers when it kills them. A bit like when um, the Netherlands boat, whatever it's called, when that captures another boat, when it destroys another boat, it actually captures it. Um, and it seems to heal as well, do these orcs. Um, what strength do they have? 14 strength, 2 movement. Uh, replaces a swordsman of also 14 strength. So, Mordor are clearly a warlike nation, but they're not as warlike as I thought. So I was hoping more of a legionary type of unit where they have extra strength as well, but apparently not. Ah, we've met Angmar, um, the Witch King of Angmar, my servant here, um, but of course this is all completely random, and we're at war with him right now. So he's, he has found Khandum, whereas I found Barad Dur. Um, yeah, lots of gold around here. Um, I want to find a religion early on, um, religious orcs I think we should be. Um, it is on King difficulty, I think. Yeah, King. Um, small but 14 nations altogether. Ooh, lots of wheat here. Bananas as well. Maybe the Sun God Pantheon belief might be best. Um, plus one food on bananas, deers, and wheat. Right, so we found Gondor. 
Yep. I've just got to check for our Gondor's advantage. Um, we of course have some units. Um, workers build faster. Free work at the start of the game. That's good. Hmm. Um, this unit here. Um, defensive unit only, I think. I, I don't know. I, I'm only skim reading that. And oh, hold on. Citadel Guard are mainly a defensive unit that becomes stronger closer to its capital. Ooh, that's interesting. 16 strength replaces pikemen, also 16 strength. And Iphilian Ranger. Um, yeah, so they have some advancements as well. Interesting. Hmm. I need to look into this mod in more depth. This is, by the way, the first time I'm playing this mod. Um, let's hope this series actually records. Um, and without any problems, because as you may remember in my America series, as I played it as a random nation, um, yeah, that didn't go too well. It got about three episodes through, and then I just started getting copyright claims. Um, that's the reason why the soundtrack right now is off. There's a brilliant soundtrack with this mod. Um, I'll leave a link in the description to it below if I forget, which I probably will. And just remind me in the comment section, and I'll add it. Um, yeah, brilliant soundtrack, but sadly I cannot play it because I'll just get a copyright claim. Um, yes, yeah, so... Oh well. Right then, so, ah, the dwarves. Um, ooh, do these have a gold advantage or something to do with mining? Um, how do you spell dwarves? Well, I spelled it right. Um, double quantities for all mined luxury and strategic resources. Yeah, obviously. Or even as the year that they lived in, in Middle Earth years as well. Aww. Um, 15 production of land units, yeah, so they have a forge there. Oh, just got to check all these nations. Angmar. Um, oh, a snow troll. They seem tough. Um, Witch King. Their cities at double speed, so it seems to be a bit like the Huns, I think. Um, yeah, like hobbits and what's this Jewish? Oh, the places for Wavia. <laughs> Hobbit holes. Oh, what do these do? Um, food, I think, and a bit of culture as well. Um, a bit like for French. Um, what's it called? Ah, France have something. And their leader, after discovering Calendar, the next three cities founded each provide two luxury resources. So these are like Indonesia then. Right, uh, look at one more. Um, it's got to be Rohan. Something to do with horses, yep, clearly. Um, well, yeah, just a horse nation as we expected. Um, they're on stables, they're on Rohirrim cavalry. 24 combat and it replaces the knight also of 24. Oh, 20 combat. Any unique things? No, not really. No, nothing super special. We, we've also got all the wonders to check out as well. Ah, here is a Gondorian spearman. They've even got the artwork of them all as well. Oh, this mod is brilliant. Right, barbarians. Right, let's get a scout. <sighs> oh, I'm tired. Ooh, I've done an attack for barbarians, but... Yeah, I'll do it anyway. I think I can win. So, um, I'll usually turn battle things... Oh, no, 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 no. no. That I just have to see these graphics and like all the different changes that have been made. I just have to see it. Ah, the elves, the high elves, or um, El Eldar elves, it calls them. Let's see what they're of. Um, Lancer, 
um, probably replacing the Lancer and the Forge and yeah, culture as expected. I think there's another group of elves as well somewhere. Um, the what's called the Sylvan elves. Yeah, the Sylvan elves will be somewhere as well. Come on, my brilliant orcs! Build an empire in the rise of Mordor. Ooh, they're stealing my resources. Might have to buy some tiles. Yeah. Right, heal for a little bit and then go for this other barbarian encampment. How's Bavadur doing? No, it can't reach this other source of bananas. Oh, can it? Nah. Can it? One, two, three. Nah. Nah. Sadly it can't. I'm going down Piety to start off with and I'll be going down Honor. Um, because I need to find religion and Piety does really help with that, so that's a route that I have to go down. I'm done. I'm not having any choice about that, that's where I'm going. They're helping both aggression and something else as well. Um, what, what am I on about? I, I'm completely lost, I'm just making up things now. <laughs> right, I think I'm fine to attack. My arcs aren't fully healed, but they'll do it be good enough. Let's explore north. Right, just in a... Where is it? Um, quick movement. Yeah. Actually, we don't have our arcs yet, so quick combat as well. There we go. Yeah, that's much quicker. And we want a shrine. And... Um, well, we don't want to go for our arcs. Um, oh, we want Baradur as well. Reduce cost of building units by 20%, provides a free castle. Yeah, so I want to go this route. Any other new unique wonders? Gondolin? No, we don't have mountains, so that's not useless, but... Yeah, it's useless. <laughs> um, Erebor? What does this do? Bit of gold, bit of production. Yeah, we don't plan to build many forges or workshops, really. Minas Tirith, I want an extra trade route, but no, we're done be at war too many times to trade. Some early ones will be good, but yeah. Golden Hall, this is for Rohan. Um, yeah, that's good for Golden Ages. Um, Isengard, three great scientists, yeah, we want that. Um, minus 20% production needed to build meal units, so I'm really go for philosophy. And then down to metal casting, because things will change um, as the game goes on. But because, for example, I'm going to start off with going for quarry. Nope, drones working, so we can. Oh, no, let me think. Yeah, that'll be fine for the bananas. Then we can just go straight to that. We won't be needing these things soon. Yeah, then go for mining. Well, we'll sorry how when we get there. It's just... Have a plan in mind, I think. There. We'll go for that, and if we need to change it, we'll change it. It'll be fine. Okay, so... Don't seem to be anybody else north. Ah, took a lot of damage there. Need to start healing him up again if he survives. Better survive. Yeah. Oh, more barbarians. Um, heal. Yeah, retreat. Don't want to get attacked twice in one turn, that would not be good. A pantheon has been founded um, by an unknown civilization. Ah, Isengard, yes, finally, Isengard. You could be a good ally of ours. 
as we work together to rebuild the followers of Melkor. Ooh, that'll be our religion name, I think. Yeah, followers of Melkor. That's, it's got to be that. What else can it possibly be? Right, hopefully we should be able to kill this barbarian, get the gold from taking this. Um, greenery for this extra food, but I'm actually going to go worker. Oh, out just in time to build um, the plantations. So confusing because my um, logo thing here looks similar to um, the barbarian one as well. The Easterlings. Camel the Great of the Easterlings. Um, don't know much about the Easterlings. Um, they're somewhere between Rohan and Gondor side and run near the Andu around the Anduin I think but are they near um, Kand near Harad if you don't know the Lord of Rings I'm just speaking complete gibberish right now <laughs> so Solomon's mines have been founded not a Lord of the Rings thing but oh well here one more turn and then I'll attack him where's this barbarian going Oh, it's drum over this way. Oh well. Could try and kill him. Give it a turn. I should go for honour. But I need to find a religion. So Oh, at the very least a pantheon, so what I'm going to do is I'm going to have to go for this. Double my faith. Seems necessary. I won't survive if I make it go that way, so I have to go for this south journey here. Attack for barbarian. Ah, another two banana resources. This could be a good place for a city if it wasn't too far away. With cattle as well. Ah, gate right. Hold on, one, two, three. Nah, I won't be able to get the wheat in, but... Oh well. My empire will be definitely built in this direction, though, to start off with. Ah, the hobbits. Oh, What brings you to the Shire? Ah, oh, the hobbits. <laughs> um, barbarians. Kill them. What do I want from this? Um, don't want to heal. Um, don't go for rough terrain because it seems like most of the jungle around here. Oh, should have healed to be honest. But it looks of all those barbarians. Far too many there. It's only two, but that's enough to kill me. Oh, just survived. Got to quickly run away. Orcs running away. Um, yeah, hopefully I don't find any more barbarians. Oh no, it's three sources of banana. That means I won't really need the wheat. I think I can settle a city here. Yeah. I think this is a good spot, but it's population-wise, though, well, definitely. Right, kill this. Um, 17 turns until our next thing, and then we'll start going down. We we'll start going down honor in 17 turns, basically. That's the route I think we've really got to take. Heal. Finding all these natural wonders. Let's see, what is our city actually doing? Um, you know, I'll let, I'll let it reach 5 population first. And then I'll take a look. Healing very slowly. Um, Yeah, I'm happy with this. Um, prefer production 
Nah, nah, this tile's better than definitely. Yeah, keep how it is. Um, oh, shall we work together with the elves? No, yeah, no, yeah, 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 yeah. It'd be, it'd be fine. <laughs> Got two luxury res resources here. We'll be needing more than that eventually, but... Um, because we're going to be a very wide empire, probably the widest game I've ever had. And yet we're in a good position to build tall, but oh well. Easterling territory here. Oh, sadly, I think we might have to go for Angmar first. Don't want to because we're meant to get along, but we might have to go for him. Either him or Umbar. We get along with Umbar as well. Why is it put us near our allies? <laughs> oh well. I, I was thinking of doing teams, but I decided not to because I don't really know. Just decided not to. Um, yeah, Sun God is best, I think. Well, we are going wide, though. We want. We don't want to go too tall. for some god. I have a tall capital at least. Um, don't want a granary, otherwise we'll be getting too tall then and that could just cause problems happiness wise. Um, You know what? Um, warrior, we'll go with for now. Um, explore a bit down here because I think we might be able to settle a city here. Um, well, we should be able to, but it depends what it looks like. Oh, got to wait one more turn. Um, Isengard finding the second sitter here. Oh. oh, of course, of course. Um, we actually need to clear the jungle first. I didn't know that. I thought it should just. I thought like, the jungle had to be there. So, oh no, uh, this this has ruined it. Um, <laughs> right. Um, let me think. This would require a trap, but we'll need to clear the jungle. This needs quarry. Um, these need clearing of the jungle. So... What to do? Okay. Clear the jungle. Then masonry. Yeah, go this way because then we can train spearmen units out. Um, and we'll get archers. Yeah, that, that's probably how it's got to be right now. Um, so this worker can't do anything except build a farm here. No, I don't want to buy a tile. If we're careful enough, we might be able to use him to explore a little bit. Save our warrior time when he comes out. Right, yeah, it seems safe. If they have a scout there that's still alive, then it's probably safe. Um, getting trapped with these mountains. Oh, 
Maria Mount, or Mines of Maria. Similar shape, just wrong angle. Yeah, could use this to our advantage as some type of defence. Ah, have had good another ally. But you won't be an ally. We'll be at war eventually. <laughs> just a shame about this desert. What's it like here? Ah, so if I settle let's say here for example, then I can reach both sources of fish. It's coastal. But I don't like this desert. Here, one, two, one, two. Yeah, here could be better. Mm. Oh well. I I'll I'll decide when it comes to it. Right, remove this bit of fog of wire here, it's a bit annoying. Right, would have researched mining soon, so best bring him back home. How strong are doing? Strange, I start with a worker, but they don't seem to be working much. Oh yeah, hopefully we should find no bugs. Um, we could of course be problems, I probably will be. Um, but yeah, hopefully we don't find any. And another barbarian encampment. Ah, hobbits like us because we like the elves. That's good. Okay, build a mine here. I don't have a clue what to do, just keep on exploring. <laughs> um, I've got a great general, they better not steal up my land. <laughs> if they do that could just completely, be, I'll be going to war almost immediately if I did that. Right, I want another, I want a settler, settler, yeah definitely. Seeing as well technology is I might as well get another city up. We're not going to kill this barbarian. One of these is going to steal it from us, but oh well, we might be lucky. Oh, oh, who was it? The stupid Easterlings. Kill him anyway. Go down on her. Come on. I've adopted my point. There we go. Um, Explore this coast with my scout, I think. Um, while we come down this way, there's meant to be about six city states. Um, yeah, so hopefully we might. I, I doubt we'll find them soon, but we will do eventually, of course. They've got to be somewhere. Like right, he, need, he needs to heal. Bring Urk back. Ah, so Umbar have a settler. They're going north. We'll be at war soon, Umbar. Very soon. Has anyone founded a religion yet? can finally build a mine once this turn is up. Um, don't want to build a gondolin. Yeah, work with the hobbits. We need to build some friendships early on. Especially with far away nations. 
because we won't be going to war and backstabbing them. Ah, so they found another city. Um, yeah, not pronouncing that. World and mine, six turns. And he's done have nothing to do again, but oh well. Could build another mine here. That'll probably be best. Trade embassies yet. Oh well. I, I like all the symbols. Like you have the white hand of Saruman, the tree of Gondor, the snake of Halad, um, the Saruman's eye. Hmm. Decent spot for a city here as well. Let's hope Isengard find that city so we can then take it over. Eventually. Right. This one is just walking around in circles on this tree now. <laughs> Don't have a clue what to do with it. Ah, so the map expands up here. Wonder how far it goes. Isengard, depending on what this looks like, could become a, a good trading nation. Doubt it, but you never know. Nah, not really. Seems to, yeah, it ends. Oh well, sorry Isengard, trade won't be your thing. Ah, good. Um, wheat. On the mine. Um, how do I go wheat? Yeah. Give us a bit more growth, but not too much. Settle. Yes, finally. Um, yep. And we can go there and let us find our next city. What shall we call it? Oh, no, we'll just name it after what it is. Um, don't have a clue why it's, why it's going to give us, but oh well. Um, Gondolin, no, plus 10 defense, we don't want that. Plus 10 offense, that's it, but no, I don't need defense. I'm gonna go a warrior. How strong is their city? 12. Just thinking, shall I just pour in loads and loads of warriors? Well, I'll go warrior. See how it goes. Eventually, we'll be getting spearmen. Ah, um, which king has gone to war with Gondor? Hopefully the Witch King wins. Ah, might be a change of plan. If we go to war with, uh, work with Gondor against the Witch King of Angmar, then we might be able to take at least something out of this. Right, prepare for war anyway with Angmar. We probably won't, but it's possible. Ah, here are the hobbits, camouflaging in on the map. Or maybe they had to stick to somewhere over here, like the Shire, but here is Hobbiton. Um, their capital should, could be the Shire, or it could be Bree, Breeland, don't know, whatever they'll call it. Right, settling is unguarded, but I think it's safe. Ah, Camel has completed um, Gondolin. Camel is, of course, the Easterling. I say of course, but you probably don't have a clue. <laughs> Ooh, what's that? Nah, I thought they had a unique unit that made a certain sound, but... Nah. Oh well. Hmm. 
right, so I will zoom in through for this one, I think. One, two, three, four. Yeah. So better. So Mount Doom, yeah, obviously Mount Doom. And from this we want. Still got us on Mount Doom. Ah, Mount Doom, and um, we want a shrine. Yeah. And I don't have a clue why you're working that tile. That one will be loads better. Um, I'm going to build a monument. A monument towards Melkor and a shrine towards Melkor as well. Right, we've just done a land on this hill anyway. Oh, Gondor lost its capital. Right, so. Gondor has lost their capital. They're probably out of the game. No, we're still in the game. Um, one city left. That'll be either Pelagra or Ostiliath. Hmm, well, that's unfortunate for them. Right. Ah, another war. Um, what are these? Saruman has declared war on Angamite. Angamite? He's one of the leaders. Ah, yeah, Umbar. Saruman against Umbar. Um, I want to go to war with Umbar as well. So I'm going to bring my soldiers over here and hope to grab their capital city. That would be very successful. Might not happen, but I can dream. <laughs> If I don't take anything, I can always raid the land, get a bit of gold out of it, so it's not going to be too bad. Um, three turns until bronze working. Don't really want another warrior. I prefer this. a spearman, but. Do I really want a scout? <laughs> um. Ah. There's nothing that I actually want to build. I think the scout will be best because it, it's the closest to something that's not a waste. Oh, too unhappiness. How are we meant to take over cities when we're already unhappy with this? <laughs> oh well, um... Anyway... We'll be wanting to go for... Um, the banana. We've got truffles, but um, we'll need to trap him first. So, yeah, we'll go for bananas. Uh, what's going on here? Yeah, growth is stopped, but it's okay. Um, ah, the goblins, Azog, from the Hobbit film. Brilliant person there. I like him. And what's the capital of the Hobbits? Yeah, the Shire, of course. Could have been Bree, but no, it's chosen the Shire. Oh, they found another one. Tuckborough. I've heard of that. I think it's mentioned in the books somewhere. Oh, they're trading with me as well. In that case, I might go to all the Vizen guys. Keep changing my mind. We'll see how it goes when it happens. Let's wait. Ah, a religion has been founded. Um, Arnor has become Catholic. Yeah. Right, let's get Spearman out. Stronger military. Um, yeah, fortify this warrior. Helm's Deep, 
Yeah, it doesn't look that defensive, but it's not even next to the river of a mountain, but oh well, could have been worse. Um, what am I going to do with this scout? Can I make it through here quickly before the gap of Arnor closes? The famous gap of Rohan that they tried to go through. I think it's in the books. I don't think I don't think it's in the films. I don't think they mentioned it. They might mention the gap of Rohan somewhere. Etamors. Um, yeah. I have a big load of things then. Well, all of Middle Earth actually. Um, I haven't sadly read for Silmarillion yet, but um, I want to. Ah, so the Hobbit unique unit. Yes, the Hobbit Sheriff replaces the Warrior. It's good. Moria? Ah, yeah, I, I naturally assume Moria to be owned by the Dwarves. Um, but of course it's goblins in this, which is understandable. Um, yeah, I can understand why they chose Moria, of course. Um, come on, Isengard. I don't know. Yeah, they might take this so soon. I'm, I don't like them having an ar archer there when I don't, don't have archers. It's going to be a risk. Yeah, we need the gold. Always sell a few embassies on single play. If it's multiplayer, I can understand if you don't sell your embassies for one gold per turn. But yeah, multiplayer, you might as well just do it. Right. I'm going to war this turn, because I think I have a slight advantage of their archer being out, and this being capturable. But can we get like a, some form of deal with Isengard with it? So I'll declare war on Umber. And you have nothing to give me. Would you give me that? <laughs> no, that's not happening. Um, how about we come, we come friends with Nah. I'll declare on Umbar and give it as a gift to you. Oh, maybe not then. Anyway, I'm going to war with Umbar. Oh, it, it disappears, doesn't it? Oh, you're a complete idiot. Oh, well. Hold on a minute. Prob probabilities should look loads better for me with this. It's only an archer. Oh, well. Yeah, we're gritting this while I've had it, as long as we ruin Umbar a little bit, then it should be fine. We're not really after the city right now. We just want to cause a bit of damage for them. Slow them down. Ooh. Um, Embassy 35 gold, yeah. Our Isengard and um, Umbar are signed piece, of course. It would, of course, that would happen. Um, You take that. You made. Yeah, and you've improved, so now we can pull back a little bit to heal. It's all about raiding and destroying. Now Gundabad here. Was Gundabad in the Hobbit films? I think so. Could be wrong. But I think it was. Right, so, um, yeah, this soldier is dead next turn, unless I heal him. No matter where we move him, they'll be in range, so yeah, healing. Nothing else I can do, so I'm just going to retreat. Come on, orcs, get out of it, right. 
is going to be pointless from now on so I'm just going to delete him. Might as well build up the gold a little bit more. Withdraw. Spearman in two turns. Oh, they've killed my warrior. So anyway, moving there was pointless. But, but we slowed Umbar down a little bit, so yeah, it was worth it. bring the spearman back home but he's he's going to have to act as a scout right now just to explore what land is exactly here oh stupid dwarves oh come on what have I done just it's all about going to war with me right um I'm going to go for an archer instead. Um, you're going to have to heal. Scout come round here, away from Angmar. Yeah, keep building that plantation. Building it, don't stop it. Um, well, might as well five on him first and then kill him. Good. Right, Spearman has done, I think, most of his exploration now. Yes, build it. Peace Treaty with Umbar. Um, not yet. I, I like the goblin, goblin symbol, the spider there. That's good. Right, I'm not signing peace with Umbar yet because I want to destroy their gem source here. Right, he, he can explore this way. He, hopefully he'll make it through Angmar alive. Probably won't, but we'll give it a go. Ah, good, we've done that. Um, I don't have trapping yet. Um, can't get past your... So it's going to have to be... Ah, should be able to get the quarry. Oh, I haven't researched that yet. Apparently not. So that'll be next. Well, oh, this is so confusing. <laughs> um, okay. Granimal husbandry, no matter what. Then we might as well. Either way, it doesn't really make a difference. We'll do that. It'll it be, it be okay in the end. Um, you build another plantation. Right, you move down to defend Mount Doom a little bit. Yeah. Otherwise we'll get distracted when the black gate opens and it'll all be over with. Uh. Right then, um, destroy these gems. Let me just take a look. Yeah, it should survive. Might even get to capture a worker as well. 
I doubt it, but you never know. I would have an archer now. What are the dwarves like? Um, dwarves. Uh, they have jungle, so my archers will struggle. Could have an archer here and an archer here to fire in. Capture an arrow bar would be good. Two should have sort. Sorry. <clears throat> Two should have sources and marble. Or oh, angmar. Gold. 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 Marble. Gold. And I bet there's more gold down there as well. Ooh, a bit of ivory as well. Uh, I think not. Accept embassy. Yeah, sure. More gold for me. Do that. Do that. And then sign peace. Hopefully they should accept it. Um, can I get anything out of it? Nope, didn't think so. So peace for peace, yeah, that's okay. I got a worker out of it, destroyed the land, but lost a warrior. Um, overall, I think that war was worth it. Um, people will, of course, disagree. Um, just remember, I am still kind of new to Civilization V. Um, I've only had it for about three months. Still, 200 hours, but three months. <laughs> um, not what we have had on the other hand, so that's all okay. But I'll be wanting to take this city someday, so still I'm going to prepare for war, get my archers ready. Um, Umbar is definitely one I want for those gems, and just to more consolidate this part here. I have a captured worker, so... This is a hill, so I can build a mine there. I want, I want that. Um, yeah, yeah. I don't think he'll make through the gap of Angmar, but... Oh well, he tried. That's the important thing. That's what all of Mordor should teach. He tried. And then it'd be a much nicer world. Let's sign peace. Come on. Peace. Peace. No, they're not going to accept it. Oh well. They'll lose him eventually. How, what soldiers do I want? So I'll be wanting about three archers, two spearmen. That should be enough. Possibly a third spearmen or three archers, two spearmen and a warrior, something around there. Ah, fear and nah. Don't want to find myself in too many wars. Struggling with population, not population, unhappiness. I'm on three right now. That's not good. You prepare for war with Umbar. And you heal. After you've done that, I want a caravan. I of course want this, but now nah, I won't get there in time. Some someone's gonna beat me to it, I think. So, yep, not much I can really do right now. Um, it's all about pe yeah. preparing for war. And annoying Umbar as much as possible. Ah, got another spearman. Um, bring this one round. Yeah, this way. Leave him there. Leave him there. Bring him round and look here. Um, no, we can't perch just now. Ah, we can. We can. So that should speed the entire process up a little bit. It'll cost us a lot of gold. Still going down three gold per turn. Hopefully this caravan should get us at least four gold per turn. That'll be good. Um, once I get peace with the dwarves, I'll be trading it to Erebor more than likely. Just seems like the trading sitting with it being dwarven and full of gold. So yeah, that's probably the route I'll go to. 
Ah, and of course I'm getting gold from signing these embassies, which is always good. him out of this as well, just speed me up to get my next policy. Yeah, that's it going away. Ooh. Um, I'll just check my religion over you first. So, the hobbits have founded Shinto, which is like the Japanese Buddhism. Two religions left. I'm not nervous. Um, I won't be training male units for a while. Um, my experience, not yet. Um, oh, what should I go off? Doesn't have to be strength. Yeah, clear that. Yeah, see, I would not have completed that in time, so I just figured I didn't waste um, hammers on it. Fangorn, founded by Isengard. Come on, I need peace. I don't want to go to war with Umbad until I've got peace with these two. How long does an archer take? Four turns. Put that in the queue. library has been built. Um, you know, it just says far away land. Kill these barbarians, get the gold and the culture. Culture and 25 gold. Yeah, that's great. Um, oh, no. um, can I build? No, I went for trapping, trapping first. Um, you go down here. You get the iron, and this one will go for the truffles. And then that'll be my first luxury resource. Yeah. How far am I from Orcs? Um, so I won't bother do it first. And then... Yeah, still quite far away. Um, especially with technologies taking 160% longer to train. Mm, I like it, but... Might be a little bit too much, I think. More like 80% might have been better. But if it wasn't an 80% mod, it was either 30% or 160 Eyes and guard, that looks like the best one. Come on, we need peace. Right, I won't do anything with my caravan for this turn. Because I think we'll be at peace soon. Um, I will rush my spearmen back home. See if we can make it without bother healing him. You go there. Ugh. Even brute.
I love the sounds of them. It's a good mod for this one. Very good. Religion enhanced, um, of course, I know with uh, Catholicism. Come on, we need peace. I'll give you two more turns. Two more turns. If you went out of peace, then you don't get my trade. That's what we're going with. however you pronounce it. Well, anyway, he's completed these Stonehenge, so he'll be finding a religion soon. Um, yeah. Right, last chance now. Are we at peace? Ooh, we've done a good two horses as well. Can we get a bit of gold out of this instead? Three gold per turn, good. Can't complain there. Three gold per turn, from the dwarfs are doing nothing. Angmar won't accept you. Um, oh, Isengard is still the best one. Hmm. Alright, I'll go for it. Where are their units? So they have a warrior there. Just bring my archer down. Yeah, and I'll be going to war with them next turn. One of the spearmen, just in case if something goes wrong. It's unlikely, but you never know. Oh, I know. Um, what shall I say? I I'll tell him the truth. Yep, we are going to war. Lost a bit of health here, which was unfortunate, but... Hello. So, this archer moves here and might as well begin the firing. Um, unfortunately they haven't rebuilt this, so now I cannot destroy it and heal. But oh well. Could be worse. Three hatches firing into the city. Ooh, almost lost that spearman there. That look, that's not good. Might have to just retreat him for a little bit. Mm. Let's sign peace with Angmar so they don't thank him from behind us. I'm worried that they're building up an army here to attack Mount Doom. That's what I'm worried about most right now. Hopefully they're not, but they might be. Heal, and um, you stay there, and you're going to have to retreat. Yeah, retreat. Ah, good, we've got a luxury at last. Um, remove this marshland. I hate marshland. Um, yep, pasture. So, um, this probably here would be best. You know, I'm gonna keep him here so that they don't fire on this spearman. And instead, we go for him. Yeah, that'll be the best option. I hope. We killed him, but. Oh well. Firing. 
get another spare man in one turn. So, now here for now. Um, can't play martial end yet. We can in four turns. You know, we'll wait for four turns. Yep. We won't be stalled. Keep us funded. Oh, come on. Why? Why would you go to war with me? If anything, this war helps you. <laughs> um, well, this war with Umbar, I mean. Um, this is Flatland, isn't it? Yeah. Ah, great person has been born. Good. You move there. Then Spearman can move here. What is this one? Um, Dwimmer Lake. Um, is this a Nazgul? Yeah. But they can have golden ages. So is it a great artist? Or is it a bug? Um, Hmm. Doesn't say anything about Golden Age. Yeah, so he's like a mixture between a great general and a great artist. Hmm. Interesting. Heal. Um, yeah, get another, get a caravan out. We need some extra gold. Right, what? Oh, come on, Isaac Guard. Why? Why now? Why would you do it now? Um, Hopefully you should take the city, yes that's good, um, create a puppet, and then, you move there, then you move there, can we sign peace with Angmar, nope, come in with soldiers now as well, um, right, this, actually, this, this worker so is in danger, so move him this way, Been founded. Um, Rohan has founded Buddhism. I like Buddhism. I wanted to found it. Right. You don't have to pull back with my side, she will get me. Um, um, this way. Right. Um, don't have to fire on him. Spearman kills him. He goes to safety. Yeah, that's how it's got to be. Um, right, I'm at war with three nations right now. Two in the north, one in the south. I'm more scared of the one in the south. <laughs> um, we should be at peace with Israel soon, unless we've got some super wild, aggressive thing going on. That could be a problem. I might like just never sign peace or something like that. Can I purchase any farm of units? Can get an archer. Yeah. Ah yes, um peace treats it. Yeah, I've got to accept that I'm desperate. Even though it won't help much but 
it'll give me a bit of cover at least. Yeah, so, world's most progressive people. In that case, I'll be at the bottom. Oh, Azog is less progressive. Writing. Oh. I need to get this actually to um ah. move on the hell, he's under threat from him. I think he'll be okay. Yeah, we build that. I want to use him to build a citadel to like quickly grab a luxury from someone, one that I don't have. I can't see any around. Um, to... No, I can't even reach the gold. Ah, maybe I can. If I... But, but let's just check. Um, yeah. Purchase these two tiles. Don't have a gold, but if I did manage to then. I'm gonna build a citadel here. I capture a gold source. Anyway, I'll leave him for now. What have I been guard doing? I'll just retreat. Have a full retreat. Building that pasture. There we go. have founded their new religion so I haven't founded a religion sadly and um, yeah that's a big shame but oh well nothing I can do now build a quarry, but I want to repair this tile first. Okay then, so, situation right now, war well with Isengard and, oh no that's not happening. Um, how about piece for piece, yeah piece for piece works. Um, Einmar has a chariot archer. I hate Angmar right now. I'm going to go take a city from them. Um, probably not Kandun, be more like just Angmar sort of thing. Um, Archers will be difficult because it's got hills. I've got a lot of archers, so that's my main strength. Sadly, my people are miserable at minus three, so that's my main weakness. Um, Spearmen is what I need. Yep. 
go to Everbar. I'm done. So, anyway, I've been going for about over an hour now. Um, I, I don't, I don't know how I'm going to upload this. Is if it's going to be 20 minutes episode or something. Yeah. So, um, anyway, yeah, that, that's going to be it for this episode. Um, I need a break, so hope you've enjoyed this video. Like it if you have. Um, yeah, subscribe for more Civilization V, Rise of Mordor. I'm very tired, as you can probably tell, but I'm enjoying it. Bye.